Aaron Black the versus half the cast. Basically. And this is the Aaron Black player that sent him to losers to begin with. So that's that means Moscow is going to have to be playing against someone who beat him. Beat him to reset the bracket and then beat him a second time. Right. So that's, that's going to be a tall order against someone you lost to. I want to see if his Gears, if he'll stay with the Gears all the way to Grand Finals. Yeah, it'll be interesting Ooh. to see if that's what he picks against Aaron Black. Mm. I'll be right back. Give me all one right. second. I can handle color in between commentary. So hope you're all having a good time, having a party, enjoying yourselves. Uh, we do have a match arena up. If you use the code QUARTERS, that throws a hot 50 cents into our prize pool for this night. Uh, up to 50 bucks, we're paying out top one. 50 to 75 bucks, we'll pay out top two. 75 to 100, we will pay out top three. The goal is to get to that $100 mark without without me throwing my own personal cash into the mix. That's what we're trying to work out here. You know, support the Utah FGC. Also, this event normally is at Quarters Arcade Bar in downtown Salt Lake City. If you didn't know, we're in a pandemic. There's a virus out there. So if you feel safe going out to a bar, wear a mask, sanitize, shower, social distance, go to Quarters, buy a couple beers from them, because our government doesn't really give a shit about its people, they were forced to reopen so they can pay their bills. Um, otherwise, maybe go to a Quarters Arcade, quartersslc.com slash shop. Maybe buy some merch from them, right? Support them, I'm keep them up. open. We want a home to come back to when they get here. Looks mm -hmm. like we got our boy Mormo back, which means without further ado, we are ready to jump right in to Grand Finals for Mortal Kombat 11. Right. I'll uh -oh. stick it with Street Fighter for now, so. Okay. Moscow disconnected. He oh, also read the no. script. Oh, he read the script. Oh, uh, that he was pitch 28, script. right? All right, while well, that happens, actually, we're going to go to this little video and I'll reinvite Moscow. You can visit the Match Arena page for our event and contribute in many different ways. One, free coupon. Click contribute, enter the specified coupon code to contribute a predetermined amount of money to the prize pool. Two, free sponsor quests. On the right side of the screen are various actions supported by sponsors, including retweets, Twitter follows, surveys, among other things. Click into these boxes to complete the action and add the attached prize contribution to the pool free of charge. Three, marketplace. Products are available in our marketplace, which also contribute to the fundraising pool. Be sure to check out the variety of apparel and collectibles, as well as other unique items. Four, donate. Clicking on the contribute button, you're able to add funds to your Macharina wallet and then directly contribute them to the fundraiser page. Thanks for supporting your event with Macharino. All right, we got Mozco back in the lobby. It's like we figured out what's okay. going down, and it's like right. Max should be joining us here in a second to help commentate Ooh. this Grand Finals. Yeah. Mozco right. bringing out that Mosco. Liu Kang. The Kung Lao. Not Kung Lao, excuse me. Gears. I don't know who these characters are. All right, you boys got this. I'm going mute. It was close All enough. Right. It was a Shaolin. It was close enough. One of the Shaolin brothers. Uh, challenge number two, so. Alright, well, let's get our grand finals started here. Oh, Starting wow. out with a back jump into dive kick. Classic? Classic? You know, it's Kung Lao. Just start your round like that. What are they gonna do? Punish you? Of course, what are they gonna do? Ooh, that's an escape failed attempt. Next throw oh, is a wow. crushing blow. All right, we got plus frames on that orbiting hat. Yeah, plus Can't... frames, orbiting hat, very dangerous. Got to hold that, have to block. Oh, tried to go for the interactable. Was that on purpose? I don't know, maybe it was. Yeah, it looked like that uh, definitely dropped it. It's like a throw or something. However, that interactable works. I don't know. I think it's a grab. It looked like it. That's a punish, though. That's what that looks like. All right, Moscow taking first round. Let's All right. see. Oh, blackout! Not pulling around. Stick into uh, starting out with V three. Ooh, double burn. Okay, I see oh. you. Yep, that double burn. Just trying to catch him off guard. And just like that, no meter. For now, and now he has meter. <laughs> it comes back fast. Yes, it does. Right, we got a back throw here. 
We're taking him out of the corner. Yeah, that's a good breakaway because now you're out of the corner. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because Moscow was going to side switch you there in that combo too. So that was a pretty good time. It was a good time to do it. Ooh, goes oh. for the third shot. Normally, he did two shots, but this time he was going for the third. Yeah, Moscow in trouble here. Oh. Oh, yep, yeah, and that. Yep. Yeah, he's oh. saving those bullets. He's saving them bullets. You never know when you're going to need them. You never know, man. You never know. That takes his final round. Empty hop. Okay, I see you. Moscow does that a lot. I don't think Blackout's really fallen for it yet, though. Oof. All right, well, we got a we got a big boy combo going in here. Oh, jump over, good stuff, blackout. No falling for that. All right, well, there's our interactable, but he drops the combo. Got blackout got hops of his own. Yeah, blackout has hops of his own, huh? Yeah, both of them like their hops. What else can I say? Yeah, and now Moscow takes the first game. Nice. All right, well, that's your first. That's your first win. You're gonna need two more to reset this bracket. Let's see if Blackout has anything to say about it. I think Moscow can definitely reset this bracket, most definitely. Uh-huh. Uh, more than any other player that has joined in our tournament so far, do I have more confidence that Moscow really can take it. But Blackout's been playing amazingly every time I've seen him. Yeah, most definitely. And Blackout. Blackout, Moscow have been playing great. Most definitely. So let's oh, see how right. this second match goes. Yeah, I like we saw. Yeah, Doctor connects again. Once again, once again, that script. The script says it all. So Tom, Tom, we gotta reinvite him. Tom. Ah oh, man, he followed the script. I know. So oh, no. Like we saw last time, uh, we saw blackout actually towards the end there. Is that Moscow to... that dropped? Yeah, it was Moscow yeah. that dropped. So we saw Blackout uh, at the towards the end when he lost. Switch the variation one. I don't think he'll do it quite yet. I think he'll do it if he loses one more time. I'm anticipating Blackout will stick out variation three for at least one more game, at least for this upcoming game. But that's what I'm seeing because uh, otherwise, I, I don't think I've ever seen Blackout play another character to my knowledge. Um, I haven't seen it. Um... He's definitely going to stick with the... Uh, I definitely don't think he'll switch characters at all. I'm wondering if he'll ever switch variations against Moscow. That's that's the big question. Yeah, that's we will see. I have. All right, well, we got our boy back, so we'll be uh, starting the next game two of our grand finals very shortly. All right. Huh. Ooh, uh, stretching. I'm a little sore. Okay. I'm a little sore. Logan and Kung Lao and Aaron Black again. Hiking for three hours. I gotta do my little stretch. Gotta stretch these muscles. I've been really sore these past couple days. Ah. Ugh. Every joint in my body is just popping. Ow. All right. Well, none of them switching. Blackout sticking out to variation three for one more game. I think he really will. St I don't think he'll switch. I think he'll switch if he like gets like washed out in the brackets reset. Yeah. But I definitely think he'll. He can definitely stick it out. Oh, that's an accidental breakaway for sure. Yep, it happens Ooh. to all of us, and yeah. especially. How? Why they haven't fixed that input? I still do not know. Mm -hmm. Oh, using the interactable to get in. Uh does the jump kick a little too early if he waited a little longer crossed up and hit him but that's okay okay we got him in acid everything's all right yeah everything is all right he's staying in that acid yeah it didn't it wasn't wasn't it moscow last tournament that did that like he just happily stood in the acid the whole time <laughs> he's like you don't your acid does not frighten me no i'm wearing shoes like that's what shoes are for <laughs> yeah and those the shoes, shoes will are melt acid. The shoes are not oh, acid. Oh, tries to go though. for the throw and reads it. Oh, goes for oh. throw again inside the acid. This is going to be death. Yeah, that's an acid throw. 19% of your health gone just like that. Throws yeah. are normally 14%, but he can he can take a fifth of your health like that. Got to be careful. Oh, oh, tries to 
go for the trap, but the hat's able to catch him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Aaron Black's hat is a little too tall, so when he sets down the bear trap, he gets he gets nicked by that orbiting hat. Ooh, barely able to dodge with the back jump. Oh, there you go. Stuffs his attack. Oh, tries to go for the enhanced trap. Doesn't Ooh. fall for it this time, but you know. Oh, tries to go know... for the throw. Oh, oh takes the throw. Whoa, oh, look both at these of pokes. <laughs> Just both poking each other out. Look at these trades. What is this? Uh, Ooh, oh. Oh, that's stuff. trying to go for the interactables. Yeah, this is a very, oh, very. Inside good the stage. acid. This is not where he wants to be right now. Double oh. acid. 17%. Oh, no. The overhead. Oh. Oh, it gets caught! Oh, oh the buttons! Oh, and the breakaway, and that's gonna probably kill! Uh-huh, yep. Yep, 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 and it's yep, gonna, yep. yep, it will. And now, going into the final round, Blackout has no defensive meter. Oh, both of them don't no, have defensive yeah, neither meter, of them so do, let's see actually. how well, <laughs> let's see what they do. I had to double check that. I was like, really? I didn't, I don't remember them, like, spending all that meter. Oh, oh, it's able to fully punish! Ah, uh, he foibled. Oh. He foibled the input there. Oh. He bubble wobbled it. Bubble wobbled it. Oh, trying to go for the low into the rifle. Ooh, oh, there you go. The back throw. All right. Oh, nice. The rifle. Mm -hmm. Because that is second hit is flawless block. Oh, nice flawless block. Oh, block attacking the overhead kick. I see you, Mosco. Ooh, stance oh. cancel, but gets checked by the down three. This is what you get for trying that out. Oh, the cross up. Oh, this kills. Oh, that's yep. going to be death. This is game All right, Mosco, two. 2 0. Uh huh. We're one good away from resetting the bracket. Dang. See, yeah, that's in the script, Marmo. Like, 2-0 and then possible reset, right? Yeah, two. Yeah, both of them are actually gonna they're gonna make it to two two, and then Moscow's gonna win and reset the bracket, and then he disconnects, and then both of them go two two again. At least that's what it says, you know. They don't have to follow it. They they've just been following it and up until now, but they don't have to. Yeah, I mean, let's see how Blackout adjusts because it seems like Moscow has definitely adjusted since um last set he was playing with uh Blackout, so. Honestly, like even though it's a 2-0 right now, locked and loaded's just fine. I think his issue is just that he gets opened up. I don't think that's like a character issue. I think he just gets opened up from Moscow. Moscow, when he does his combos, there's a lot more damage than Aaron Black. So I think really, uh, Blackout has to be way more mindful of opportunities where he can't get opened up. More mindful than even Moscow has to be about with uh, Blackout because yeah, you'll take damage, but you won't take like nearly as much damage as when he opens Blackout up, right? Yeah, most definitely. So let's see if Blackout is able to adjust to avoid this reset. Mm -hmm. okay, what does he need to do? Yeah, Moscow yes. 2 -0. Moscow 2 -0. All right, how are we gonna start this match, boys? Walk back, oh. whiffs the uh, button there. Okay, ends the stream. Double. Two hats. Oh. oh, into the throw. Wow. Okay, so you let Kung Lao burn both of his orbiting hats, so he's one million frames plus on block, and you just throw anyway. Oh wow, he gets caught by that. Oh, tries to go for the interactable. Yeah, whiffs the interactable there. Not too sure oh. what happened. If nice that was jumping. on purpose or not. Oh, what is happening? Mm, Ooh, goes for the throw. reversal throw again. Okay, Ma Okay, Blackout, I see you. Oh, yeah, they're nice. really calling out Mosco blocking way too eagerly. It's the word I want to oh, use, I think. Those hops, those hops. They can confuse the hell out of you. Yeah, Mosco. Oh, Blackout gets caught by the poke. Yeah, that see, that's another problem Blackout has with this matchup. He's getting opened up by that down three way too often. And I think he needs to, like, Moscow keeps trying to take his turn back with that down three. And I think, I think Blackout needs to keep him honest and pull out something of his own to stuff that down three. Ooh. Well. 
Looks like uh, Moscow is just taking his time, just throwing the hat. Ooh, he keeps the hat, be able to get some pressure. All right, well, he's got no oh, meter left. by those mid gun. Uh-oh. Oh. Yeah, he tried to walk back there, but got opened up by the button. <laughs> by the forward three, I believe. Oh, it gets opened by the forward three again. Mm -hmm. No meter to amplify it. Oh, the missile kill. Death. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Uh, Aaron Black did a lot better this time, mostly because he was just outside of the range of that down three. So he didn't really have to worry about it. It looks like that's definitely his trouble spot right now. It's dealing with yeah. Kung Lao's down three. Into the orbiting hat, too. Got another orbiting hat coming up. Oh, down three into the orbiting hat. Oh. Trying to go for, oh, forward three. Back two. Oh, the poke wars are happening. Uh -oh. oh, gets caught with the one. This is it. This is the combo. This is a big boy combo. Oh, it gets oh, opened up again. Yeah, I'd break out from there, buddy. I'd break out there, too. Oh, gets caught with the hat. Is he able to fully confirm? Oh, it's going to be dangerous territory for Blackout. He's got to be careful on his next move. Oh, keeping it safe with the overhead. Okay. Oh, oh stance, stance cancel, cancel in your face when your health is this low? That's pretty... Oh, kind of ballsy. Kind of Very ballsy. ballsy. Uh-oh. Oh, great flawless block by Moscow. Able to reset the bracket on that. Mm, yeah, that's one thing Moscow's got over Blackout. He's definitely uh, repeatedly expressed his proficiency in block attacking and flawless blocking everything uh, Blackout's been doing so far. And that's just an advantage Blackout has to overcome. Yeah. If he All wants right, to we take have his grand a... finals. And we've got another reset bracket in the MK11 tourney here in SLC Bar Fights. Mm-hmm. All right, and now... Now is when I am anticipating to see Blackout switch to Variation 1. Because I think what's really eating him up here is... Yeah, is that... Is, he's not really getting those setups on Mosco. He's not getting them, like, bear trap setups, the asset setups... It's not really working well on him. And I think with this, with this, uh, this particular idea of his, I think is going to work out a lot better for him, especially with his pressure. No, also noticing Moscow oh. just really isn't getting opened up by the, say, random mix-ups on the special cancel that is safe on block. Yes. The rifle swing thing in the bobber, so not well, falling for that. Yeah, the bracket has been reset. Blackout changing the variation from one Aaron Black. There you go. Yeah. Consider the best Baron Blackberry. Oh, accidental breakaway. I told you we need to fix that input, Marma. We do. I know. But that is so annoying when it happens. I know. Imagine how Moscow feels right now in grand finals after resetting the bracket. I, I wouldn't be nearly as happy about that. Yeah, me neither, man. Well, let's see if we can make this comeback from full health. Oh, the overhead. Ooh, barely able to catch the jump out. Did, did that hop attack catch him out of the air? Yeah. Pretty crazy. That's pretty oh, good. Catches the mid. This might be it. Oh, this might be it. This, I don't think this will kill, but it's going to be very close. Is he going to make this come back to full health? No. If it kill, if it doesn't kill, he gets it's him out of the corner. Kill, but gets him the life lead. Oh, gets the mid. Gets the mid, but is able to convert. Oh, the stare down, oh. though. Oh, oh. <gasps> nice. Blackout, what a want? comeback from Moscow. Did you see Blackout just stance cancel in his face when he had zero health left? Are you crazy? Are you crazy, Blackout? Trying to confuse him, but oh no. How is he going to come back? Let's see if he's able to keep his composure after that. Because losing a match when you have, like, very close to killing your opponent with one combo, well, that's got to hurt. Mm, I wonder if that was a messed up input there. That acid throw looked a little too far oh. away. Just a raw orbiting hat. Oh, tries to wake up, gets just stuffed by the Ooh. swing. Once again, Moscow opts in for the throw on your opponent's wake up. Okay. Oh, the mix up. There you go. Here's the 19%. There you go. Oh, throw, throw again. again. All right. All right. Both in fatal blow territory. Oh, just the draw down three into the orbiting hat. Dang, Moscow, Moscow making this look quick. Yeah, Moscow making it look quick. See if Blackout can adjust. 
Mm -mm. No, he definitely looks like he's in trouble now. Yeah, it looks like Brackett he's in just reset on him now. and he just lost a game. I wonder what uh, Blackout's gonna do about that. Yeah, how is he? Is he going to switch characters? Do you think? These are the scariest of momentum shifts. I know. He just yeah. beat him too. He beat him and he sent Moscow to losers mm -hmm. and now he just got a br bracket reset on him. Yeah, and and it was a bracket sweep as well. So how he's gonna keep his composure? Does mm -hmm. he have his composure? Can he focus now? Because now he is in a he has a deep deep hole to crawl himself out of he right still, now. He can still make it. Like remember, like all Moscow needs to do is uh, win a set once. Moscow has to win it twice. So Moscow now Moscow's about once. even. Moscow already won one set. Let's see if he can win another. Is this going to be a bracket reset sweep? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I definitely think blackout. I think he really can figure this out. I don't think he'll let it sweep. I don't think he'll make it nearly as easy as Moscow wants it to be. I well, definitely I have, have faith in him. Nice throw. These throws are catching blackout off guard. Mm -hmm. Goes for the down four poke this time. Not nearly as fast as Kung Lao's down three. I oh, imagine, tries to but... go for the low mix up, gets caught, but not able to fully convert off it. Yeah, drops the combo there. A little unfortunate there. Yeah, he had no bar to amplify it. Oh, it dropped. Didn't drop the combo, but has to break away right there. The sweep. Keeping it safe with the overhead into another sweep. Oh, it's just keeping it safe right now, but it gets Jeez. caught with the orbiting hat. Is this something he, he was not getting caught by in the last set? Yeah, it looks like Blackout keeps getting hit by the Orbiting Hat, and when you get hit by that Orbiting Hat, that means he gets a full combo conversion off it, too. So that equals big damage. Yeah, but Moscow in complete control right now. Mm. Moscow able to make these adjustments. Let's see if Blackout can. Down one game with the bracket reset. Ooh, there you go. Yeah, Scud shot that hat. We don't let them, do don't let them oh. get away with it. Right back in. Oh, the throw. Aaron Brack has a long throw range. Whoop. Oh, and wake up buttons. Because it doesn't have any meter to amplify it. The throw again. Ooh, oh, nice you see that? Yeah, look at that air confirm. Good stuff, yeah. Blackout. It gets the mid combo, breaks out of it to avoid the damage. Keeping it safe with the overhead. Ooh. Uh oh. Oh, but oh. Uh, trying to not press buttons. That time. Oh, but oh, what just happened the, there? Oh, Never dropped well. the fatal blow. Goes to the back throw, but Blackout can take it. What you gonna do, Blackout? Oh, tries the fatal blow. Oh, is it able to be in punish range? Oh, it just buttons, buttons. Oh, Pokemon uh -oh. going yeah, up. Oh, a, the throw again. That's game two. That's game two. That's game two. Ooh. Yeah, I think that's right now, that's Blackout's biggest issue, is that he keeps getting hit from that orbiting hat. And I think, I don't know, because the way Moscow plays it, he's, it's like, he doesn't, you don't know when he's going to throw out the orbiting hat. He hasn't been very predictable, I think is the word I want to use with it. So that, that definitely would be a trouble spot for Blackout. Yes. In my mind. Also, he, I don't know, it just looks like uh, Moscow has just been doing a lot more whiff punishes out out in neutral as I well. I think the main thing is that Moscow is doing way more throws because he's noticing that Blackout is blocking a lot. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And now with these throws, he's expecting a throw after these down threes. And he's going for the opening hat as well. And that's ca that keeps catching him off guard. Listen, that's what makes Kung Lao good is the fact that orbiting hat really just all it does is enhance his striker throw mix up. So that's the scary thing about, and that's what makes him good. And sometimes it just really isn't, you know, there isn't a, there's no good answer for that. That works 100% of the time. Sometimes you just have to read See, the look, player behind up the Kung Lao. The when you have it's a game mad, plan man. that solid, what you need to do as a player is read the player behind the Kung Lao at that point. That's what you need to do at that. Okay, but Blackout getting some good, getting good combo damage right here. But with the interactable Kung Lao right back in. It looks like in this match specifically, Blackout is trying to keep him out. 
But he's going in. Oh, mm -hmm. the mid. Oh, it gets caught with throw again. Yeah, once again, that striker throw mix up. Back throws into the corner. Oh, the throws. Forward These throw throws this time. are letting Mozko just. Abs oh, the orbiting hat! Trying oh, he to got counter hit. it. Yeah, but he got hit by the orbiting hat, and now he gets 30% for his troubles. Oh, no. Oh, it's close to death. Oh. Trying to go for the low. He's going for that way too much. Yeah, this is definitely a. This is definitely. A tough matchup. Uh, yeah, for this Aaron is, Black. This is um tournament pull Oh what a flawless block on the overhead. Up two oh. on that overhead. That's the second time we've seen Mosco capable of seeing the overhead kick and flawless block attacking it. Yeah, but oh let's see. Can Blackout just pull this out because he is just being destroyed by these throws in the set. Where in the last set, he was just dominating with these blocks and reads. Oh, he's playing so well, but Moscow able to read him like a buck right now. Oh, the, oh, isn't able to punish the throw. All right, well, we are currently tournament point right now. Unless Blackout can take the rest of his health out. Oh, finally able to throw escape. Nice job right. by Blackout. All right, well, he's got not much health left, especially if he's gonna stand in that. Oh, oh with punish! Oh, uh, he's trying to get the version. Drop. Un very unfortunate drop. This one combo can be it. The throw escape oh, uh, failed. Yep, that's an that escape throw fail. Throw can do it. Oh! oh! No that's need. Version. No need. Wow. Oh, and mm -hmm. Doctor Mozko, the bracket reset and the double sweep. That's a set. You that's a six-zero madman. Your champion for bar fights and the friendship. It's not the friendship. It's a stage fatality. Fine. This is, oh, this is a little less friendly. It's a little less friendly. But Moscow six-zero against the person he lost to. Amazing comeback, really, for this tournament. Good stuff. Good stuff indeed. Damn. Both players had fantastic showings in this tournament, but Moscow able to beat Blackout. But damn, mm. what a, man! What? That, that, a that's a two. We had. Good stuff. Good stuff for all these players coming in. Moscow taking first, M2S Blackout taking second, and Paladin taking third. Great showing here at SLC Bar Fights for MK11. Uh, Mormel, if people wanted to interact with you on the Google webs, the internets, what would they, where would they go? What would they do? Well, I currently make uh, I make guide videos for RoboCop, and I'm thinking about uh, doing one for Noob Cybot as well. I want to pick him up. I make videos about them on my YouTube channel at Mormel. If you want to catch me, you can find me on Twitter under Mormel Carrion, or you can just chat up with me or any one of us here in the Get Good FGC Discord. And Max, yeah. how about you, my dude? Uh, just catch me on Twitter at MWHARP. My Discord is also MWHARP. I'm currently really into Among Us right now, so if you want to play Among Us, and we can find the imposter together, then just hit me up. I'd be glad to play with you guys. I so just, thanks for joining us. I just bought that, so I'm down. Oh, it's a lot of fun. Oh, let's do it. Let's go. Let's do Get it. Get good Thomas. FGC Among Us. Let's mm -hmm. do it. Let's do it. <laughs> All right, boys. Thank you so much for your comments here tonight. I really appreciate it. We are going to take a quick break while I get Street Fighter V booted up and get Jocks in the Box here to join us for commentary. Thank you all for tuning in. Tell your friends. Uh, we'll be right back with a winner's round... Uh, winner's? I don't know. I have to look at the bracket. It's going to be Blanca's Electric versus Anti-Rex. Winner's quarterfinals. Street Fighter V coming at you hot. See y'all in just a second. You can visit the Macharino page for our event and contribute in many different ways. 1. Free coupon. Click Contribute, enter the specified coupon code to contribute a predetermined amount of money to the prize pool. 2. Free sponsor quests. On the right side of the screen are various actions supported by sponsors, including retweets, Twitter follows, surveys, among other things. Click into these boxes to complete the action and add the attached prize contribution to the pool free of charge. 
3. Marketplace. Products are available in our marketplace, which also contribute to the fundraising pool. Be sure to check out the variety of apparel and collectibles, as well as other unique items. 4. Donate. Clicking on the Contribute button, you're able to add funds to your Macharena wallet and then directly contribute them to the fundraiser page. Thanks for supporting your event with Macharino.